Welcome to section 2.1 homework. We are going to look at how to find a relative frequency distribution using StatCrunch. So the first thing we want to do is open up the data set in StatCrunch. Go to graph and we want to do a bar plot with summary. The categories are here, never, rarely, sometimes. Those those are stored in response. The counts are the frequencies. Remember I told you frequency is a fancy word for count. And we want a relative frequency. Relative frequency, a fancy word for percent. And then we want to order this. I just want it to go in the order that is in the worksheet. So never, rarely, sometimes. You can change this to have the values descending or ascending and so on and so forth. But we're just going to go with whatever's in the worksheet, and then we'll uh, display the value here above the bar. So go ahead and compute. And there we have it, folks, the relative frequencies for each category or the percentages. So we'll go ahead and type these in and move on to the next problem. 0.076. Point four six nine, point two four one, and point oh two five. Okay, folks, see you next time.